Hey Stage Right Secrets, it's Gabby and I'm here with Tragic Thrills in Las Vegas. Now I need you all to describe the person next to you. You're starting. I'm ah. describing the person next to me. Well Cameron's like our health motivator. He keeps us all in check. He checks my form on my push-ups. So, you know. So does that mean I have to describe you or Zach? <laughs> Okay, uh, well, Zach is a very nice guy. He's very well rounded. He gets a lot done. I would say he's like the mature, actually, not anymore. Between Zach and I, he's like the mature one, but I think in the band, he might not be the mature one anymore. Yeah. I mean, he's, I've set the iron up for him. He still doesn't know how to iron his clothes, so. <laughs> I would have to say it's Anne's is the mature one now. Mature, okay. Anne's, uh,. Dutch, <laughs> a Dutch uh, enjoys steins and, and lederhosen, and um, that's about it. That's about it. Ah uh, man, Christopher, uh, foot long, <laughs> foot long personality, um, anxiety during chess games, and a great guitarist. Thanks, Hans. Who am I describing? Gotta get Gabe. Oh, Gabe. Gabe's a uh, really talented guy. He's great at arrangements and he's great at piano and he's like the musical uh, director. That was good, you guys. All well, ace that test. <laughs> First of all, congratulations. You are now signed. Yeah. That's a huge deal. And you're going to be re releasing your self titled debut on September 30th. What else can we expect? Because there's a lot happening. Um. Uh, um. No. <laughs> No, uh, so yeah, the record's coming out uh, at the end of September, and um, it, it's just a good opportunity for us to. We just Washington Square is an awesome company, and uh, just we have a new life. Like with as the band is our first time on tour, and so everything's coming live. So we're doing a bunch of live things. We're gonna do a, like a live performance and put that on the record as well, I think. And uh, it's just uh, I don't know. It, we're just we're revitalizing the. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, He's grateful, is what he's trying to say. <laughs> now, you guys are saying this is your first time touring all together, and you're testing things out. Has anything gone wrong? You you have a story, obviously. Let's see, do I have a story? Has anything gone wrong? Gone wrong? Well, I mean, a couple of tires exploded. So. Oh, wait, okay. Yeah, he's gone. Okay, you got one. When we were uh, driving up to the, wait, gone wrong this tour? Yeah. Okay, we were driving up to Seattle, like three hours into the first day, <laughs> and, uh, we like just completely exploded a tire and almost died. While and Zach was hovering over all the gear and said, Chris, don't get in an accident. Yeah, exactly when he said that, tire explodes and then we had to wait for like seven hours for a uh, tow service to replace the tire on the road. <laughs> and we kept going. So that was weird. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> Um, now, the lyrics and everything is very well put together. It's very thought out, I would say. Thank you. Is that what you guys were really trying? Did you take your time with this? Definitely, yeah. Um, it was... I, personally, I like to do things over like a long period of time, so I don't like write a song in a day, usually. It's like I write a part, and then I let it marinate for a minute, think about it, and then keep working on it. So yeah, like I think uh, definitely what we did was the best thing I was able to do at the time, so yeah, uh, it took a long time. It took a long time. Yeah. All right, let's have some fun. Now your van is over there. Would your moms be happy or disappointed in how dirty it is? I think they would actually be impressed because we've been doing a good job of keeping the trash out, or at least I have. I pick up everyone else's trash. I know so I've been doing that. So who's the dirtiest? Um, I don't know. I think it's just. Everyone combined. I notice is Anne's pouch is like pouch in the van is always full of candy wrappers. <laughs> Snacker. Hence the name like Dutch Candy Boy, aka Candyman, aka the Bishop. So he he's kind of a troublemaker in the van. Now who out of you all is most likely to get in trouble while they're in Las Vegas? Gabe. Definitely Woo! Gabe. Oh shoot! <laughs> Thank you so much, you guys. <laughs> For what, though? Uh, no comment. <laughs> we all have girlfriends except for Gabe, and his nickname, uh, because of some of the actions it's he's done. We'll leave it at that. We won't explain it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His name okay. is just HYD. HYD. Which stands for Hide Your Daughter. 
So. <laughs> oh! So there's a secret that we just got out of. So your mom's what? not going to want to watch this. Oh, no, man. Because he is a great teacher and he just wants to educate women um, on respecting themselves. Okay. Yeah. And Vanessa on Twitter, we had fans submit questions. She wanted to know if someone offered to pay you a million dollars to change your genre, would you do it and what would you change it to? I would definitely change our genre. I would just, because it's already like alternative indie-esque. I would just make it one or the other. I would just pick one genre and just go that way. Yeah, so that sounds great. Everyone agrees on that? Yeah. He's like, no, rap. I mean, actually, that's a funny actually. story, because in high school, this guy had cornrows. <laughs> so it fits. So yeah. It says back in the, well, I don't even want to say it. Do we get to choose the genre, or is it, do we get to choose the genre? We'll let you choose. Okay, then yes. Who would have the creative mugshot out of you all? What? Hide your daughter. Creative. Oh, no, it'd definitely be Zach, because he'd be so scared. Yeah. Zach would be so scared if he was in jail. It's not creative. I'm not going to be... You do the arms out thing. Yeah, I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> Pose pretty nicely, like a schoolboy. <laughs> it's a school picture. Yeah. Smile, there it is, there it is. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'd probably screw up and be too nervous and smile. Yeah. You know what I mean? I could see that. Yeah, that would suck. I would probably just try to look as tough as possible, <laughs> which is impossible yeah, for me. Yeah, you're like, so, this yeah. is my one chance. Yeah, I'd just be like... You would, like, fix your hair. Yeah, probably, right? <laughs> all right, thank you guys for chatting with us. Make sure to hit them up on all those great social networking sites.